inception. Now, before you bother telling me it's impossible. It's no, it's perfectly possible. It's just bloody difficult. Tristan, as Arthur keeps telling me it can't be done. <laughs> Arthur. You're still working with that stick in the mouth. He's good at what he does, right? Oh, he's the best. He has no imagination. Not like you. Listen, if you're going to perform Inception, you need imagination. Man at the bar. Cobalt engineering. That price on my head, was that dead or alive? I don't remember. See if he starts shooting. Then when we take him a level deeper, his own projection of Browning should, should feed that right back to him. So he gives himself the idea? Precisely. That's the only way it will stick. He has to see himself generated. Eames, I am impressed. Your condescension, as always, is much appreciated, Arthur. Thank you. I will right, try this. Um, my father accepts that I want to create for myself, not follow in his footsteps. That might work. Might. We need to do a little better than might, Paul. Thank you for your contribution, Arthur. Forgive me for wanting a little specificity, Eames. Specificity? A kick. What's a kick? This, I am, would be a kick. Couldn't have peed before you went under, sorry. A bit too much free champagne before takeoff, eh, is it? Aha, uh -huh, bloody hard. You mustn't be afraid to dream a little bigger, darling. We run with Mr. Charles like we did on the Stein job. So you've done it before? Yeah, and it didn't work. The subject realized he was dreaming and his subconscious tore us to pieces. Excellent, but you learned about, right? He's gonna help us break into his own subconscious. That's right. Security's gonna run you down, huh? And I will lead them on a merry chase. Just be back before the kick. Go to sleep, Mr. 